Hello everyone, welcome to the channel, uh, it's Rad, and uh, it has been a while. Well, for all of you who are following me and uh, you want to know what happened, it is that I went to a, a vacation a month and almost a half ago, and right after that I went quite sick actually for about a couple of weeks, maybe even three weeks. And then I needed to, you know, to recover, but hopefully I'm back with, uh, with the videos and, uh, that's uh, pretty much what happened and why I was, uh, why the daily readings were a uh, pretty much absent for a month and a half. So with that said, um, now I'm going to shuffle the cards for the upcoming, uh, daily uh, daily reading which is going to concern the 5th of uh, September 2022 and uh, if you are interested into having a personal uh, reading with me or um, if you do want to uh, take my classes you can check out uh, the description down below and uh, there you're going to find a link to my website uh, where you can view and uh, Purchase whichever service uh, suits you best. So, with that said, uh, the first card for uh, Monday, 5th of September, uh, is going to be the Two of Wands, uh, followed by the second card here, which uh, pretty much stands as uh, the uh, Six of uh, Swords. And uh, the third card for this Elemental Dignity Spread. Uh, that is going to be the Knight of Swords. So this is uh, pretty much uh, how the card stands. Uh, and we do have a twice of a active friends in today's reading. So Monday is going to be quite of an interesting day for what we can see from these cards. And it's a day where we should actually... Uh, listen to what people has to tell us our co-workers our friends or even <laughs> even well i think most importantly um, our significant ones the loved ones that comes from the uh, two of wounds with uh, the knight of uh, swords and these two cards represents those kind of a talks or says divulging of information, if you will, uh, that will allow us actually to put on already existing accomplishments. Okay. And uh, so that will allow us to extend further into what we are already good at or what we are already considering a achievement of, uh, of ours. And uh, it's uh, it's just the with 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 these two cards is also um, prominent to get into a coalition or a cooperation, if you want to say it that way. Uh, but these revelations, so to speak, that are going to come from a, a society of people or someone in specific, they're going to be a little bit harsh on us in a sense of that they are not going to be sugar-coated in any ways. And if we do have our ego um, unchecked at that particular point, or if we are in generally very proud of ourselves and we think, you know, we are more than others because there are such people, um, then it's not going to be one of the most pleasant days talking with your neighbor or talking with your friends or you know talking with in generally with those that you do associate yourself with that we all associate uh, ourselves with uh, and uh, with these two cards as well by talking with these people that will allow us to kind of align <laughs> our emotions with what is best to be done at that point so bottom line from that expression it is at the end of the day it seems that either we are going to convince ourselves that it is good doing what you have to or uh, even better that what we that we are going to discover that what we have to do is actually something we would like doing at the end of the day and uh 
If up until this point we have resented certain decisions we recently made, uh, Monday it's a good day where we are going to give ourselves a, a logical explanation why we, do, why we did those choices and uh, a, a rational explanation to it. Therefore, uh, we are going to start feeling less and less resentful of them. For example, uh, if you made the hard choice recently to leave your relationship because of you know your own reasons but you resent yourself from it and uh, today in monday uh, you may find that this was a logical choice it was the best choice ever that's or rather like it was the best choice given the situation and therefore that resent you have towards yourself is going to start disappearing is going to start melting uh, the other uh, the other elements of dignity that we do have, which is the six uh, of swords with the two of wands, that put a little bit of a bosey approach from our behalf throughout the day. And it's actually a day where through the, these ad advices that we're going to receive from these people, beloved people, or, or co-workers, generally people that want to see us growing, okay? Uh... They will breed a confidence within us that is different from ego, right? So the conf confidence being confident that no matter what, things are going to turn out to be better than they are right now. And, and that's literally what the case is with uh, with those two cards. And actually now that I think of Six of Swords, it's a, a perfect card having it there. It is because in one of, it's, in one of its... Um, manifestations it is when everybody unites un under the common cause or under a, a common goal and so with with these interactions that we are going to have with that person or the society of people we are going to unite under that common cause and that will allow us to build on top of it so bo bottom line guys for that particular day monday it is that we do have a opportunity if you will uh to build on top to improve our family to improve our job to improve our contracts all right or even to improve our friendships whatever we consider being an accomplishment uh it's it's something that we can expand even further on i don't know how to put it into into english so i can express it better but that's these are the best words i'm finding here and um that will happen if we learn to listen to others and the guidance not exactly the guidance but the advices that they are giving us we make choices so we do not regret those choices even if at that point you know we are dragged to something else but we know that if we do make it we are going to regret so we definitely should not make it and uh, the final condition so we can grow into the into monday at least according to these cards it is that we understand that improvement calls for stepping outside of thy comfort zone and therefore we need to be a little bit bolder with our moves and traverse that threshold toward the unknown and so with that said, that was uh, our daily tarot guidance uh, for uh, Monday, 5th of September. Hopefully you do enjoy it and you do like it. And uh, we're going to see each other next time. Until then, bye.